Good day, YouTubers, and welcome to the vlog. Just checking out. It uh, had to get up at 5 o'clock. It's about quarter after 5. 5.19. And I just kind of went through and made sure my safe was empty. This was empty. Make sure I didn't have anything plugged in. Just like usual. Just per usual. Make sure the washing is good to go. One thing I never figured out is this looks like a bit of a radiator to heat up the bathroom because there's definitely an electrical plug going to it, electrical something, but there's nothing on it to turn it on. So I have no idea what it's for. It's never been hot. Uh, this is a two stage toilet. I forgot to show you that. So that's your pee flush and that's your poo poo flush. Alright. Shut off the washer. And we're off. Go check out and uh, see if I can grab some food on the way. Because I'm going to be hungry. As you can probably hear, not a whole lot happens at 5 25 in the morning. There's a bird that sings nighttime here. Don't know what kind of bird it is, but you never ever hear this cheerful sound of a bird in Canada in the middle of the night. It's kind of funny. I'm going to put this... I was carrying my bag just so I don't sound like I'm coming this way to maybe somebody potentially not very nice. big wide streets. I can keep away from alcoves and things like that. Just in case there's a not so friendly person hiding out in there. So I'm standing in the middle. <sighs> it was absolutely fantastic. Uh, stay here. Polly, Matt, Harry and Lewis. And Stephanie, or Steph, she like Steph, uh, definitely treated me absolutely amazing. I had a great stay. Treated me like a king. King Ken. Anyway, we'll get to the bus station, get on a bus, and then we will head home. The German market isn't so happening <laughs> at 5.30 in the morning. Quite eerie. Huh. Made it to the bus station at Heathrow Airport. I'll kind of try to remember my way back through the maze to all terminal. This to all terminals, Heathrow Express Underground. So, just in case you're curious, I uh, left Southampton at 6 and it is now 25 after 8. Everybody's trying to get on two elevators, lifts. Made it to departures. Don't like anybody going on the escalators with their bags, so they have these like barriers to make it really inconvenient for you to slip through with a, with a bag. It's pretty funny. So now we're above that big sculpture. His arrivals was down there, that's where I came in. So I'm managing to uh, make my way around Heathrow somewhat easily. No problems. Yeah, it is a big airport. 
Uh, so now it is uh, 8.55, so from the bus terminal to check in, to go through security, you only took 30 minutes, which is absolutely fantastic. Toronto doesn't have a gate yet. So I hope oh, gate shown at 11 o'clock. <gasps> Yo sushi. Breakfast time. Just finished uh, shooting a video at Yo Sushi. It's one of those bars that, or sushi places with a conveyor belt and the food just moves around you and uh, you just pick and choose whatever you want and depending on which color plate you grab, depends how much money it costs. We got Santa happening. Santa and elves at the airport. You wouldn't think he'd be at the airport because he's got his own transportation. You can go anywhere he wants. Okay, I'm at gate B33. It's like 11.30. Uh, leave at 12. They're already boarding all passengers. Yeah, let's do this. I was thinking that there wasn't any lineup, but they have like this. Look at the lineup. Wow. Why did I even stand up? Jeez. Holy cow. It goes all the way down there and curls all the way back up here. That is just stupid. Jeez. I booked myself with... Um, preferred seating. So... I'm like... Out of window with lots of, lots of reg, leg room. Reg room. What am I? Scooby? So, uh... I'm gonna wait for this line to dissipate and then I'll stand up. Nuts. Thank you. Oh, I put it on the wrong page. Sorry. That's okay. I tried. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. So she checks us, and then you check us. Yes, yeah, we have to board you. Okay. Otherwise you don't get on the flight. But twice? <laughs> yes, of course. Yeah. I haven't seen that before. Okay. Thanks. Every airport does it. Really? Yeah. Not the airports I've been to. All right. She's, I said, that's interesting. We had to get checked twice. And she's like, every airport does that. And I said, not the airports I've been to. <laughs> Check twice? Come on. Redundant. Seat 50A, and it is way at the back. But at least I got a window and leg room. I'm at the very back. Thank you, sir. 50A on this side Thank window. You. Thank you.
beside me in the seat that I was sitting in, and that I was like craning back to videotape the stuff uh, of, the, of the takeoff. So she said, oh, there's a seat at the back if you want that when we're coming for a landing, because I can see that you're taping. So now I've got this view. We made it back to Toronto. We're all done on the train. Someday, maybe. Thanks for the flight. Bye. Bye. You know you're back home when you see the Tim Hortons sign. Hi, can I have a large double double, please? No, thank you. Oh, Ben. <laughs> Slowly. I'm sorry. <laughs> you guys just witnessed the moment there. All right, guys, as you can see, I am home, and the first thing Ben wants to do is to take me for a drive because he's passed his driver's license, his written one, so now he can legally drive with a, a licensed driver, and he's driving my stick shift, which is awesome. I told him, you got, you got to learn how to drive stick because driving automatic <laughs> is easy, but driving stick, you got to learn how to do that. And once you've learned it, you can pretty much get into any stick car and drive it, or manual, whatever. So, congratulations, Ben. It's good to be home. Now I can let him drive. And now it's time for Happy Birthday shoutouts for Tuesday, December 15th, and they are Noel, Neil, Ian, Angel, Lawrence, and a gentleman from Bulgaria whose name I can't pronounce. Happy birthday. And for today, Wednesday, December 16th, it is Julie, Alex, Tyler, Matthew, Jason, and Zach. Have a great birthday. Don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below as to what you have for your special birthday dinner, whether you ate in or you ate out. Don't forget to take a picture. Happy birthday.